Good afternoon, Blue Beamers. My name is Troy DeGroat with U Chapter 2, and I'm excited to partner with the team at Brighter Graphics to deliver world class Bluebeam training and customization services so you can get the most out of your Bluebeam investment. I'll cover how to show and hide tools you may not even know exist, and then some tips on how to use them as well. So let's jump into Bluebeam here. And so what you're seeing here is uh, the Bluebeam interface, obviously. I have turned off in my profile uh, all of the tools and, uh, and all of that just to so we can focus on the panels over here. So in Bluebeam review, you'll notice on the side, depending on which profile you're in, um, I am in the review advanced, but I've again, I've modified my profile for this presentation, turned a bunch of stuff off and actually put all of my tools uh, panels on the left side here. When you open Bluebeam, you might see some of these tools on the left. You might see them over here on the right. Some of them you'll even see across the bottom. So for now, I stacked them all here. We're going to go through each one and show you what they're for, what they do. And you can see here all the ones with the blue highlighted in blue. That means that they're turned on. So you can turn those on. Uh, if there's any of these that you don't use, you can also right click and just click on hide and it will turn that one off. Let's dive in and show you what these are all about. Next one is our forms. So uh, for this, I'm going to jump over to my RFI form. And you'll see on our forms tab, I believe you need the extreme version for this one. It'll give you all the tools that you need to create forms. So text boxes, radio buttons, check marks, um, lists, menus, buttons, signature fields, and so on. You can select those and go ahead and start creating these forms. Um, one shortcut I like to show there, if you do have the extreme version, you can go under tools, forms, and if your form is formatted uh, in a standard way in Word or however it was created, you can come in to automatically create form fields. And you'll see in a couple of seconds, it created all of these. And it did such a nice job that it actually named the fields as well. So project name, it sees the text next to it and names that field and so on. You'll see that go through all of these. So very cool. Uh, quick way to create those forms. Thanks for joining us. I hope you guys took notes and enjoyed the detail introduction to reviews tool panels. Reach out to Darren and his team at Brighter Graphics to learn more about additional licenses of Review Extreme or the small investment of upgrading your existing seats. And as always, if you have any questions regarding training or customization services for your company, don't hesitate to reach out to our team as well.